guys, what's up? I'm Dr. Lindsay. Today I'm here out at our farm, Ponies and Palms Show Stables in Boca Raton, Florida. And today I have Reflection with us, and she's gonna be my model, giving her a bath using Zymox products. So Zymox has an awesome equine line, which uses the same LP3 enzyme system that kills bacteria and fungus. So as you can see, Reflection has these bumps on her neck because she has sensitive skin and she gets irritated from the environment here in Florida. So I haven't treated her in a while with Zymox, but after her Zymox baths, these bumps really go down a lot and her skin feels a lot better. So let's go and I'm gonna show you guys how we do that bath for her. So Reflection is one of my favorite ponies out here on the farm. She's a Welsh pony and she's about 20 years old. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started with treating her skin infection here by giving her a medicated bath using the Zymox products. So the great thing about Zymox is that there's no steroids involved, no antibiotics. It's an enzyme that works to kill the bacteria and the fungus. So that way Reflection doesn't have any antibiotic resistance and we're using basically a very safe and no sting product that's gonna help treat her skin. So I'm gonna show you guys how to give a 15 minute horse bath that should be super easy that everyone can do to keep their horse's skin irritant free and comfortable. So the first thing you start with is this skin wash, which is like the shampoo with the enzyme in it. And then the next one you use is the skin guard that's more like a conditioner to help sit on the skin to kill any bacteria on horses. And a common thing in horses for bacterial skin infections is called rain rot. So that's something you wanna prevent and using these products will help you do just that. So before we start, I just wanna show you this sort of porous mesh brush that I'm gonna use that is gonna suds up the shampoo and make your horse bath go a little faster than if you were just doing it with your hand. So you're gonna see me using this in the video. So when giving your horse a bath or your pony, you always wanna turn the water on in front of them and point it down at their feet and start at the feet so that you can gauge how scared or sensitive your horse is to water. Reflection is being amazing right now, so she is not even moving. So I'm gonna go ahead and move up towards the withers and then get her neck, which is that problem area that I really wanna address today. And then you go all over her body. And you just get them really wet, just like that. Super quick. And you go ahead and start with your wash. So I went and grabbed my wash and this is a brand new bottle. So just making sure it's open. And they do make gallon sizes of this. This is just like the small size, but I prefer the gallon sizes if you guys are gonna do this every day to treat their skin infections. I'm just gonna dump this in my hand and just this nice shampoo for them. And I'm gonna go ahead and just put that on her neck and use my, my sudsing device here and really scrub those areas that get irritated. And she seems to like that because it probably feels good because she gets these hives and bumps on her skin because she is allergic to stuff in this Florida environment. So I'm gonna add just a little more water to my sudzer, make it really soapy. And I like to let it sit on for a couple minutes. So then as I'm working on the other parts of her body, which really aren't affected, but the whole body can use this product to stay bacteria and fungus free. It's really just amazing stuff. And everyone who has a horse should be using this as an alternative to any medications.
All right. Reflection looks so cute with all her suds on her. She's such a good pony. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and rinse down this side of her. All right guys, so I quickly went ahead and did the other side, and now I'm gonna go ahead and put on the skin guard. So this works as a conditioner, and it really gets that enzyme to seep into the skin to kill any fungus or bacteria. So I'm gonna, actually I'm gonna get this a little bit wet first again, before I put some of this on. And then I'm gonna pour this into my hand, it's great skin guard stuff to help clean up reflection skin. And this one I kind of just lather on and you can massage it into their skin. And if you have time, you can leave it on for about 10 minutes. Tonight I'm just doing a fast wash, preventative, skin care for horses. And you guys, this stuff is so great. It's so easy to use for your horses. And I recommend everyone should have Zymox out at their barn. All right, so she's gonna feel so much better after this. I'm gonna go ahead and use some more. Get it all down her side and her back where the saddle pad goes and where a saddle sits on her back to prevent any skin infections or bacterial fungus setting up shop here. All right. So yeah, you let it sit for a couple minutes. So today I'm really just focusing on her neck but you guys can put this all over your horse's body and give them a nice little spa day with Zymox. <laughs> so I'm gonna rinse it off. I'm gonna go ahead. And then I just use my hand as a squeegee. They make these little squeegee devices. If you're a horse person, you already know that and just get off a lot of the water so that she can dry off. So I'm just toweling her off, making sure she's dry, and then I'll put her back in her stall for the night. She got a night bath. Oh, it's kind of looking better already. And it's honestly like seriously kind of gone down a little bit. So, just goes to show, it makes her feel better when she's all clean. All right guys, thank you for watching Reflections Bath. And I hope you learned something about Zymox Equine products. I'm gonna go ahead and put Reflection back now. And I know her skin is gonna feel so much better. I already feel these bumps going down right now. Good girl. All right guys, one last thing that Zymox makes is this Equine Defense Enzymatic Spray. And this is a leave-on spray for those troubled areas that might be experiencing some bacterial infections or some fungus on your horse. You can also spray it where there's their riding pad on their back. 
after you ride them to prevent infections. So this stuff is awesome to use. If you guys like this video, please share it with your friends. If you have other horse friends out there that are looking for products to help their horse's skin, please share this video with them. Hit that subscribe button and remember to hit the bell to get notifications for when I post more videos.